Minister, distinguished colleagues and friends, uh, you now know who I am. So all I have to do today is to chair this session on sustainable architecture and engineering. It's focusing on the achievements of buildings, focusing on the achievements of architecture and engineering. And the format of this session will be that we've called together four experts to give us a view very quickly this morning about their subject areas. And <clears throat> we'll have, a, first of all, a presentation by Tom Jones, which who I'll introduce in a moment. And then we'll have three short presentations by experts in the field, architects and engineers. And then afterwards, provided we have time, we will invite you to give us some questions and some comments from the floor. John, I don't have any gold medals in my pocket like you do, so um, I'll try very hard to keep us very much to time. Sustainability, colleagues, takes many, many forms. Low carbon design, environmental considerations, transport location, etc. But today we're going to concentrate on the architecture and the engineering and what can be achieved in the buildings. <clears throat> so, first of all, I'm going to invite Tom Jones to uh, present to us <clears throat> on his theme. It's called Sustainable Design for London 2012. He's going to stand here, so I'm going to move aside. Um, We've heard how successful London has been. It was declared beforehand that London would be the most successful games ever in terms of sustainability. It's a requirement of the IOC to respect environment care. And we're going to hear from Tom just how well we've done. Tom. <laughs> 